guys welcome to my videos so guys today i'm gonna show you how you can use the official indian through swagatam app to apply an e-business visa to travel to india before i proceed further if you have not really subscribed to my channel please don't subscribe right now and also i would like to clarify neither i am an immigration consultant nor i am a government body so in case you take it in case you take anything out of this you do it at your own risk all right guys so let's proceed so guys i have uh, opened this up app in front of you so you need to log in first and then uh, when you click on apply for visa first it's going to ask you to pick your nationality okay now not all the nationals are eligible to uh, use this app like there are nationalities who can apply for e visa but they have to apply online i mean using the website uh, but not this app but yeah as of now 60 uh, nationalities are eligible so you need to make sure that you are uh, from there okay so you can tap on this uh or type you want to apply e visa then uh, you are applying e business visa okay and you need to show some patience also details purpose of visit so you see attend technical business meeting expert special connection is ongoing project scheme sell purchase trade sports related activity join the vessel whatever so let's say you are going to participate in uh, in a business meeting okay so that's what i selected now provide detailed purpose okay i'm just writing sample but you when you do it definitely do it okay proper all right click on next so first you need to select your passport date of birth do it as per your own case i am just doing sample okay it's not actual date of arrival date of exit uh, port of expected port of arrival so i'll just select delhi okay surname as shown in password so passport so guys always verify whatever you enter here at least two times okay if you have ever changed your name if you check this box it will ask you to change, uh, provide that otherwise that's good like city of birth country of birth citizenship national id number i am just putting sample you do as per your case religion visible mark i am writing any but you definitely do if you have graduate have you lived for at least 2 years in the country where you are applying visa i select yes okay otherwise it will ask you more information country from suggestions only okay which was this country of birth so let me see what i have here country please select uh, okay let me handle okay so i handled that pitch i just went back and entered the information again passport number like i'm just putting sample you do it as per your case place of issue date of issue of course these details you can find it out yourself but verify at least two times okay not just once two times any other valid uh, citizenship they are asking i said no but if you have definitely provide that house number village country basically you are populating your address mobile number phone number click here for same address father's detail let's say his father name was peter smith national place of birth of course you know for your uh, kind of parents you know <laughs> mother's name uh, let's say uh, nancy smith previous nationality why did i go for that <laughs> but yes if you have definitely provide no doubt 
Arjen Marital details unmarried if you ask for married they will ask for the de uh, details but yes if you are married definitely provide that don't never provide any false information it could be very it could have a very bad impact on your career and whether your grandfather grandmother project prior to refer country procedure from pakistan i select no but if you have definitely provide information present occupation i'll just say it Security, college, university, teacher, charity. Can do I have computer? No. Okay. Do I have engineer? Yes. Employer, business, designation, address, phone number. Provide that information correctly, guys. I'm just putting sample. places to be visited delhi kolkata i wish i could visit some day have you booked your room in hotel resort if you said yes it they will ask for the details okay and if you have booked definitely generally when people go for conferences and all they have that information right delhi where ex uh, expected port of exit attend technical details of the applicant company yeah your applicant company on website www.www.www.www.www. Details of the Indian firm. Address, phone number. Provide this information correctly because it can be easily verified by visa officers. So do not put any wrong, false information. It could be like very bad. This is sample. Address, phone number, example. Which way? address and phone number oh let me see if this gets accepted address oh comma they are asking let me see if i put a comma whether it will be ac uh, accepted Okay, let me handle this have you ever visited before india i select no has permission to visit or extend must in and denied i select no if you have definitely do that and show some patience have you visited any country in last 10 years have you visited sar countries except in past 3 years i select no reference name in india of course if you are going to attend a business meeting you will have that information reference name in home country have you ever arrested or prosecuted like your security questions all are no but definitely you need to read understand and then check and if, this is a declaration next it will ask you to upload your photo passport and other relevant, relevant documents and then payment of course i am not going to do that but you got an idea how to do this so thanks for watching this video please subscribe to the channel thank you